What's cracking, gang? I'm back with another one. Most definitely, nigga. Most definitely. Shout out to everybody that fucked with me, dog. I fuck with y'all for real. Hey, hit that like button. Don't ever forget to hit the like button after you watch my shit. That shit make a huge difference. <laughs> no bullshit. Top of the morning to the kings and queens out there. Salute. Yeah. What's your life really worth? What is your life really worth, dog? <clears throat> I see some of you niggas that put your life on the line. For a lot of, um... Shit that you should not put their life on line for. No, goddamn well, you only live once. Real life. Why would you put your shit on the line for some shit that's not worth it? No, goddamn well, you only live one time, nigga. Bro, I mean, when I was younger, nigga, back in them days, nigga, I used to, I used to be feeling like I was throwing my shit away. I was dancing with the devil, flirting with sin, they call it. I was flirting with sin. And the longer you flirt with sin, you gonna meet your match. The longer you flirt with sin. You gonna meet your match, gang. No bullshit. Every nigga I know on the black top that was flirting with sin, nigga. After a while, I met they match. Correct me if I'm wrong. This shit out here don't get no realer than this. Nothing under the sun is new. All them new tricks you think you're playing, that shit old. None of the sun is new. All them new tricks you think you got, that's old, gang. I'm telling you. End of the day, what is your life really worth? Is it worth you getting bagged out here in the street, nigga, toe-tagged and bagged? Is it? Is it really worth that, though? Some of you niggas be acting like it really is. On my mama till them shells get to flicking at your ass. I got popped up before. I already know how them shells feel. I know how it is. Real life, I know how it is. End of the day is, what's your life worth? I knew what the fuck my life was worth then, nigga. I knew what it was worth then. It wasn't worth that. If I felt it was, I wasn't going to be living out here too long, nigga. I wasn't going to be living out here too long like that. Hard as you is, there's always a nigga that's hard as you. There's always a nigga tougher than you. There's always the loudest that be the weakest one, too. You got to remember that. You got to stay grounded. Stay grounded first off. Fuck all the other shit. You ain't got nothing to prove to nobody. As long as you know what you can do to a motherfucker, or if that's the case, if, 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 if that's where y'all taking it, as long as you know what you can do, you ain't got nothing to prove to nobody, gang. You really don't. That's being a man. That's one of the things of being a man. Not scooping at these niggas' level. I learned that a long time ago. A lot of you niggas be so quick and willing to scoop to the next man level. What did you prove? Once you scoop to his level, all that's going to do is get your head rocked. If you ain't down or dead, you're going to end up in jail. For years to come. Come on, guy. Come on now. Some of you niggas be like, dog. 
Look, you got buddy buddy them to prove something for that shit ain't worth. <laughs> buddy buddy them ain't gonna take care of your family or your kids when you up in that whammer. Buddy buddy them gonna be out here trying to fuck on your uh you know what I'm saying, your wifey or whatever the case may be. Buddy buddy them gonna be out here trying to eat off your plate you had going. Stand at your crib. Doing that thing you was hoping buddy buddy them don't gonna do. <laughs> And that's how the streets trade on you. It be the same nigga you know. You been fucking with him. Yeah, high. Be that nigga. Knocking your woman. Whooping your kids out. Playing stepdaddy. Spending your money. Next thing you know, they gonna move. Be up out of here now, you looking stupid. Let me tell you why. Because you didn't know what your life was worth. You put your life on the line, nigga. For some shit that wasn't worth it, nigga. Some of you niggas get these women, my nigga, and you let these women throw you off all the way. From what your initial goal is. From what your initial plan. You know, you'll let that woman throw you off. You thinking about what this woman doing the whole time. You forgot what the man upstairs set forth for you to do. Real life. And then, bam, that's where you get led into that snake hole. That lion pit. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's real. I feel like a lot of young brothers don't know that though. A lot of young brothers probably ain't got nobody out here to tell them that. But you got younger other bitch niggas who tell you preaching. And you only preaching because they don't want to hear this shit. Because these niggas' mentality ain't smart enough. They ain't got enough capacity in their brain to hold this type of knowledge. They only know rob, steal, back door, shoot them up, bang. And fuck each other bitches. FCDs. Living off motherfuckers. I know niggas out here still living off their mama. There's niggas out here still living off their mama, my nigga, right now. Using all their mama money up, nigga. Driving their mama whips around. Eating all their mama shit up. And don't give her nothing. Ain't got shit to give. Leeching off the next motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, man. That's foul play. But you niggas supposed to be grown out here. You niggas supposed to be... What is your life really worth? Out here just slanging dick around to these little hoes? Catching STDs? That shit dead. That shit old. That's dead. Nigga, you ain't never had no piece of pussy. Boy, you better get your shit together. You niggas skirt chasing, nigga. You supposed to be paper chasing. Probably getting to the money out here, nigga. Real life. And that's supporting your people. For real. No backstabbing. No talking behind a nigga back. There's a lot of you niggas who do that. A lot of you niggas be talking behind a nigga back. Y'all love that. And be right in that same nigga face trying to get all this information. Trying to ride the bandwagon. Trying to blow up off this nigga. Get your bitch ass up out of here. <laughs> that's cherry picking at his finest game. On my mama. I ain't lying. I sit back and I watch. I observe. That's the field I don't play in. Mm -mm. I let you niggas do that. Y'all weed yourselves out. What is your life worth? Hmm? What does it work? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'll be just tripping.
yo, look, this shit go down in the and and this shit go down with your family too. That's what's crazy. It go down in the family. So you already know it's gonna go down with some niggas in the streets. Like can't put trust in these niggas. You gotta it's only a handful of motherfuckers you're really gonna be able to trust out here. And them them is the niggas you you keep tight, nigga. Them the niggas you wing. And you bond with them niggas. Them the niggas you build an un unburnable bridge with. You feel me? An unbreakable bridge, nigga. Don't sit up here and tell me it ain't no way you can. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. It's a way. No, it's definitely, man. End of the day, man. Y'all think about that, man. You got something to say, put that shit in the comment section. You already know what up. You tell me, nigga. What's your life worth? What's your motherfucking life really worth? <laughs> to the next video, man. Colonel Slaughter is out. Y'all watch your circle before they hurt you, gang. Make sure you check in with your people, your family, who you fuck with. And stay dangerous out here because these niggas out here with it, nigga. You feel me? I'd rather be judged by 12 than care by 6, gang. I'm out, man. To the next class session. Fuck with me.